Brought to you by Aspen Avionics, the most flexible and affordable glass cockpit system. And by the Bose A20 Aviation Headset, their most advanced pilot headset ever. You know, there are lots of cool airplanes here at Sun and Fun, like this Citation CJ4. But before you can learn how to fly one of these, you have to uh, start somewhere. Hi, everyone. It's Russ Niles reporting from Sun and Fun 2011. Here's Julie Felucci of Cessna Pilot Centers to explain a unique new program that can get you in the cockpit a lot faster. We have an exciting new initiative that we're announcing here at Sun and Fun in 2011. It is guided independent flight training, and this is a cooperative project that Cessna is doing with Redbird Flight Simulations and King Schools to keep us on the forefront of aviation training. We've been leaders in flight training for almost 40 years now with Cessna Pilot Centers, and to do that, we've we've always looked at new ways to to advance flight training and help our flight training operations run their business and and excel in those businesses so this is part of all of that this project takes one of our very important strengths from the Cessna flight training system which are flight previews these are in cockpit video segments uh, focused on maneuvers that are part of our flight training system. Takes you in the cockpit with John and Martha King, who are world-renowned flight instructors, and show you how to do each of the maneuvers before you fly them. Well, we took those flight previews, and we've had a partnership now with Redbird Flight Simulations to deliver their FMX and TD flight training devices to our CPCs for a couple of years now. The customer can take their pilot key or the card and load it into the device and it will sequence to where they are in their flight training. It will load up the lesson and it comes up on the screen as you see here. They'll select a maneuver from the drop down list of you know, several choices that are appropriate for where they are in their training and then they can watch the flight preview and see point of view out of the front of the cockpit what they're going to be seeing when they're actually in the airplane, you know, cut-ins to the instruments and all of that, all of that environmental stuff so that they get a full picture of what the maneuver is going to be like when they do it in the airplane. Now, once the flight preview is complete, they perform the maneuver on the flight training device and the flight training device grades them. It scores the maneuver based on the practical test standards so that they get immediate feedback as to how they're doing. You know, were they on airspeed or below an appropriate speed? Did they have the airplane configured correctly? Were they maintaining altitude? Were they maintaining the correct angle of bank? It scores all those things objectively and gives that feedback directly to the student so that they know exactly where they stand and they can practice it over and over until they improve and, and get that right. So now when they go out to the airplane to practice that maneuver, they'll have a very good baseline of what is expected of them and also how to perform the maneuver to the practical test standards.